What is up guys, Kildan here and welcome back to the Nox Road Trip. So, in the last episode, we went out to the three pharmacies around Levenberg and stocked back up on medical supplies, mainly beta blockers since we were out of those from our murder spree at the hospital. But today, we're going back. I have gathered all of the supplies we could need, hopefully. Hopefully this is the last time I have to say that for this little escapade we got going on. I've got tools for the car if we need it. Ammo, meds, and then I got food in the trailer. Hopefully, the Zeds haven't repopulated too much. I did have a helicopter go by the base in the middle of the night, and that brought over some Zeds. I put a picture of that on the community post. Luckily, it wasn't that many, and they were walking single file, so it was kind of easy for me to pick them all off. Got a big old speed bump of corpses here. I still have not burned. I have to really just... Get to doing that. I'll do that on the stream, I think. Let me see. We good? Alright, I'm gonna drive over there. Back to the hospital. If anything happens, you'll see it. Alrighty, I'm actually going to leave the van here. Just so it's easier for Keith to get to bed. Or to get inside of the trailer. Because if you don't know, I cannot enter that trailer unless there are no Zeds. Within like a 20 tile radius. That could be quite a problem when there's a hospital full of Zeds right next to me. I'm hoping there are not many Zeds out here though. Hello, miss. I will take your goodies. That nice stick and yeah, that's a pistol on your hip as well. That could come in handy. Another M9. No ammo. That's fine. Hmm. Oh yeah, this is from. I forgot to put this away. That's fine. I'll put it in here. There we are. Okay, before we go in. What can I take? I take some nightsticks. I want to stay on level one encumbered though. I'll take two of these. Is that good? That's good. And then a noisemaker. That'd be good, I think. Uh, how about nine mil? How much nine mil do we have? Okay, let's unpack this. Open them all. It is four fifty. We have. Not a lot of daytime left, but we should be good for that. Okay, yeah. Keith's sleep schedule has been kind of wonky. That is 100% my fault. But we'll get it fixed. We'll get it fixed, definitely. But right now, we just gotta stay awake in the daytime, go sleep at night, and be on from there. Now, how many are out here chowing away? Not many, it seems. Very nice. And I did bring along this garden fork because I do want to level my spears a little bit. And spears are just good. Once you once you start using them, you just you just kind of kind of go ham with them. As you can see, great one shot kill potential. And it's just nice. I do want to take that biker's helmet. I don't think I'm gonna take it with me now, but I, I can at least grab it, put it on the floor. So let me go do that. I need to get a revolver. Put down the floor. Nice. Alright, let's go see what's happening at the emergency lane side of the hospital. Hopefully not much. It is kind of burnt to a crisp. I'm hoping the fire went completely out. I think it did because of that thunderstorm. I also can't see. Uh oh. Okay, get to the, get to the white tiles. I can actually see on them. There we go. I mean, flashlights and zombies very useful, but the way I play, I don't really use them that much. They just take up space. I do hear some Zeds. I think I just passed the stairs. That might be stairs right there, but that might also be just the reception area. Let's just walk over to the main entrance. Just see what's going on. Anything popping? Nothing? Perfect. Who knows, might be able to clear this today. Might have to make it a, a long episode for Friday. And because I'm using tab now as my aim key, I actually, I actually um, unbinded Q, so I don't accidentally shout when I'm trying to reach for tab. Hello. I saw you. So yeah, I have to hold Q to bring up the wheel to actually shout now, which is, it's, it saves me from accidentally trying to kill Keith here. Or any of my other characters later on. 
until I get a mouse that actually keeps my right click from dying. Alright, come on. One at a time now. I'm using a new weapon. Don't do the animation. That's all I ask. Look at that, one shot on that one. What are the skills looking like? Speed is going on too. I also did not read Keith's stats. Let's do that real quick. Get this out of the way so I can see. Weight is going down now. As to be expected, favorite weapon is still the crowbar. 3,577 Zads killed. Survived for one month, 19 days, 21 hours. Very nice. Come here, sir. Good night. I know there's like an algorithm for that spear lunge. As it like, I think checks for nearby Zeds, and if there's if they're too close, it just doesn't do it. I think. Is that how that works? I'm, I don't know. I'm not a I'm not a Project Zomboy dev or anything. We're modder. But from what I know, that's how it works. But sometimes he goofs up. Oh, I see y'all. Okay. Someone's moving though. Hey. Come on then. They're still coming from upstairs. As to be expected, we only cleared really the first floor. I could throw a noisemaker. Maybe I'll do that the next day. It is already 540. Okay, let's run outside. Yep, that's why we run. Pop a blocker since we have those now. We can get to work. Okay, that's nice. I don't have to tab out to run. I can just press shift and it does it. There is one behind me. Double. Almost got a triple on that one. Alright, let's switch over to this machete I got from the the main base. I don't know how good it is. It seems kind of slow. But I think it'll put in his weight. There's one behind me. Take him through the parking lot a little bit. This side wouldn't be bad for the RV either, just I haven't put it out yet. There's like a spitfuss or something right next to us. And I have not been down there. Alright, how many are with me right now? Quite a few. There's these two coming along now. Yeah, come on. There we go. Made some distance, so now I can just do this. Single them out a little bit. Goodbye. There we go, there's the one shots. Long blade, baby. Nice. Okay, let's get you. Got a little Mr. Crawler here. Miss Crawler. Got you coming over. You're munching. I can deal with you. Do a little bit of that. Get you. This is going so well so far. No problems yet. But there's always another zombie. As you can see. There's a seahorse coffee down there. Something else. Okay, let's see what these guys are. A little bit too close for comfort. Get you first here. By yourself. You little sneaky sneak. Goodbye. Dumb little zombie didn't know I was there. Then the rest of them will start coming over once they start hearing things. The wind is starting to pick up, I think. It's a bit of a windy day. Windy afternoon. Windy evening. So far, so good, though. Come on over. See you, Mr. Knife Man. Not today, sir. Hopefully not ever. Keith is gonna survive, hopefully. Except for that one time, but we don't talk about that. The part where he got bit is now out of our mind. It is a new month. IRL. New adventures. Well, kind of. We're still here, but... You get it. We are exerted. We might have to head back for the day. In a bit. But for now, let me see. Can I do anything about this? No, I need ginseng for that. And I do not have that. We do have a pistol. 
with a lot of ammo. Well, maybe not a lot, but enough. Hello, you. Is that a dumbbell on a pipe? That's new. You for me. Come on, then. Kill you all as quick as I can. Let me just put this on the floor real quick. Oh, nope. Hold on. And bop. A salvaged war hammer. That's a long blunt. Wow. Okay. That's like ultra long blunt. It's like a sledgehammer on steroids. Insane. I love mods. They're great. You gotta know how to put them together. Here are a lot of them still upstairs. Shallowing down. Goodbye, sir. Can we get a rest in real quick? If like, go over here. Oh, of course, there's one over here. Go to bed. Okay. Don't sleep, Keith. Just, you know. Try to get some, get, get some, get your, get your legs rested. There we go. They're definitely hearing me through the floor. That's how Zomboid works. For the most part, they're chowing down. Do I want to go up here first? I guess I, I really don't have an option, do I? How do I want to take this, though? Because, of course, I can't tell if they're here or not. If they're right on top of the stairs. There is a mod for that. I do know that. I just don't like it very much. Although, it would probably save my life in times like this. Alright, let's go. Oh, it's big up here. Okay, nice. Goodbye, miss. Now I'm liking all the banging I'm hearing, but I can also see them through the wall. On the way. Unless that door is also gone. Hmm. Oh, yeah, it is gone. I see it now. Get another head stomp. There we go. Alright, come on out. Gotta keep it on the time. 710. I am probably going to make this a longer episode. See one over there. I want to clear out this episode today. If it means a longer episode, so be it. It's more enjoyment for all of us. Alright, back on up, Keith. I don't like all that panic again. Get a bit claustrophobic now, Keith. Ooh. I thought I was talking to the other guy. It worked out, though. You seem to be coming out on the stairs. My bad. We take this room by room now, since we haven't cleared out this floor yet. I just gotta be careful about these stairs. Are we good? We're good. Let me get some water while I can. Oh, no, never mind. Come on, then. Are you came from downstairs? Look at you. Trying to be all special. Okay, water, now. Good, smoke, now. Got a little bit of a break time right here. A little bit of a break. Alright, we're going here first. Maybe in here? I don't like this room. This is the elevator room. Yeah, that's, that's nothing. Okay. As for the repairman and whatnot, whenever the elevators need maintenance. Okay, we good? Can I go in here? There's some good stuff in there. Hold on. Get out the way. I don't want to shoot because the suppressors still make noise. What did I, I... I saw something good in here. 35. Okay, my bag is better, but those look cooler. So we're gonna have to take those for some loot bags. 
Someone's behind me. Never mind. Let's see. What's in here? Bedrooms. Nothing. Perfect. Okay. That's done. We'll loot once everyone is dead. Or once the dead are dead. Hey, there you are. Nice hat. See, I was on point with that. With the aiming. Even though it's on a different keybind. Okay, let's check reception. Oh, these are bathrooms. Never mind. Makes sense, makes sense. Right, here comes the fire. Come on through. I can't see anything. It's okay, though. Let's get you all out of here. Back out to the main way. Come on. You see me. There you go. I don't want to round this corner and get jumped. There we go. Perfect. Nope. This is good. Double kill. Very nice. Be good. Be good. I can get food here if I need it. If I need it, I eat it. Eat some tortillas. We can use some weight gain. I didn't do anything. That's fine. Okay, that's a wall. That means this room is clear. Let's get out of here. Room by room. We got this. Sweep your sectors. As a good friend of mine used to say. Hey, they are eating upstairs. I don't like this bathroom. It's fine. Any of these moving? No. Sounds like that's the men's bathroom. Man, they really did their audio correct, though, for this game. Indie Stone? Y'all got it. Is it this one? Yep. Oh, that's a bad door. It's right up against the counter. Okay, nice. Claustrophobia's kicking back in. Let me just grab these chips. Any sodas? Nope. It is A-OK. -okay. At least out here, I don't have to worry about it too much, I don't think. It's big enough. You know, I wasn't going to mention it, but I'm going to mention it. Fire extinguisher, but having a second monitor is very cool. Just seeing my my audio levels go up and down in, in the corner of my eye. I just, I like it. Yeah, you know, it is cool. If, you, if you've been looking into getting a second monitor, definitely recommend it. I thought I didn't have enough space for it. I was wrong. It fits perfectly. I just had to rearrange my stuff a little bit, take out some unnecessary things, put them somewhere else, but... That's all I'll say about it. Back to this, as you can see. Almost just died because I'm going off on a tangent. Hello, you. Probably go down the secondary stairs, wherever they are. It definitely be secondary stairs, right? It has to be. And this place is looking pretty empty. I mean, there is still a third floor, but for now, not looking too bad. Oh, you guys blend in a little bit too much. Maybe they should consider taking out the flashlight. Well, let's head down here. How big is this? Yeah, there's a there's a emergency exit or something. Laundry room? Showers? What is this? I do think I will call this clear after this episode, though, because I'm not hearing a whole lot. There will still be zombies, of course, because corpses. I'm not going to burn every corpse, I don't think. That's a lot, of, a lot of work. That's like an hour IRL of me picking up corpses, placing them down, getting the gas, doing that, rinse and repeat for the whole building. Of course, I can speed up time and whatnot, but I also don't want to do that on stream. Because that would be just boring, honestly. I hear the, one of these guys munching, but I can't see him. To be granted, I can't see a lot of things right now. But it's A-OK. -okay. There's the stairs. Okay. 
like, hey, I was scared for a minute because I didn't know you were coming from, and you're right there. Machete's taking some damage, as to be expected. That is okay. Well, we have extras. We have to come out of the woodworks, it seems. Don't know how you dodge the fire. Hey, stop lunging at me. That's rude. That's what you get. There we are. How's a shagan? How's a bacon? Oh, we got some outside. Okay. It is nighttime, officially. The sun is set. So I will start heading. Oh, you're gonna lunch. No, you're not. Really thought you were gonna lunch there. Alright, where are the stairs? Stairs are here. Let's get out of here. Hopefully, we're safe enough. Yes. I cannot see. I'm going out here. Alright, nice. Hello. I knew they were out here. I just I didn't know where to run, so I ran through them. It worked. We got clear out this side again. Alright, let's get out the Glock for this. Yeah, there's quite a few out here. Got some pulling up behind. Reload. Let's get a little bit closer. This is a pistol after all. Does better at close ranges. Like so. I can't aim. Okay, aiming is a little bit weird. With my setup. I could not aim down there. At that, that one on the floor. It just didn't work. Don't know what happened there. Open max. Okay, quite a few of them repopulated out here. Makes my job easier. Get the fight out here instead of in there. Let me pop a blocker. I'm getting a little bit too panicked for aiming. There the hazmat, dude. Not the cure for me. I will take him. It's time to reload. All right. Walking sim, here we go. Let's just get them all crowded up. God zombies time, train them up. There you go. Let's get another mag ready to go as well. Still gonna worry about this van. I do want very nice van. Just needs a gas and battery, which we can do very easily. All right, Mister Cure Man. Give me that cure. Cure woman, sorry. Two, two, two. Nice. One more down here. No, two more down here. Three more? Two more. Three more. I see you. Four more. Nope. A lot more. Let's just say that. There's more than three. I know that much. The best spot didn't work. Good job, Keith. Your training has paid off. And his aim walking speed is very fast. I do like it. He's got them skills down packed, and they're only gonna get better from here. Hit some bullets in. Boom. Bam. Pow. Ah, didn't get her. I think we can cool it with the gun now. 9.30, Keith ain't gonna be tired for a while. Probably have to put him to sleep, put him to sleep myself. If it gets too late. Or we're gonna be out here all night, you know? Do a little bit of night raiding out in the hospital. Yeah, this parking lot's filled. I don't, it's not as filled as the other one. The main one that we parked in. The first time. But. So there's a lot of Zeds. A lot of kills. A lot of killing. Alright, come on then. Uh, 
I be a little bit quicker with the wrong shit? Put some pep in your step. Bam. Nice. One more. I don't know how I played Zomboid with, without the aim outline. I kind of... I don't know how people do it. They're, I guess they're just good. Is that another cure? Is that? Nope. Just kind of blended in with the darkness. Couldn't see real well. It looks like that has my suit, but no, it's just a... Uh, just our hair. Or his hair, I can't tell. That's a he. Yeah. Nice hair, dude. We are thinning the herd out here. Bait blocker is worn off, that's fine. It did its job. We deal with the rest without it. You guys merged, that was weird. Became one entity. This is DHL on the floor, okay. Boom. One munching back there. A few approaching. Come on then. And we are fighting well into the night here. I heard you, Mr. Satchel. Turn around. We go 180 on these guys. I see you. Nice. Okay. Let's get you. You were not on the ground, but I'll take it. Okay. Let's do one more lap around. Just to make sure we're good. Are you a hazmat, dude? No. Again, it's very hard to see. Like, that's just a black shadow. But everything is fine. We've got enough cures for now. And I don't expect Keith to get bit anytime soon, so... We'll be okay. And we might find another cure or two in the hospital itself. You never know. This is the kind of place it would be, though. Hey, a present for me. Give me that, please, sir. Give me them goods. 1911 and a 500. Alright, uh... Yeah, I guess it isn't too bad. Let's just cut through here. I saw you. Always catchy going through the woods. But it worked out fine. Just go out here real quick again. How are we looking? Looking good, if I do say so myself. We have to come back in the daytime just to really make sure. Let's do one more sweep of the first floor. We haven't really done much of the first floor, I feel like. We also kind of rushed through the second floor, but there wasn't much up there to be seen. Where are you? Do I go here? How do I get to you? Oh, I saw you. You jumped over the railing. You're there. How do I get there? Is it reception? I am confused. Oh, I see. Is that it? Is that it? Nope, that's not it. I don't know how to get to him. We'll find his way out, probably. Alright, let's hit it. What is this? I honestly have no clue. Let's close that just in case they want to try to follow me. Give me some time. I'm not sure what this is. Just, uh, offices, I guess? Filing is the kitchen. I got burnt through. Person on that one. Yeah, these are offices. Okay. Oh, I see you. You're definitely gonna have to bring a light for more adventures. I'll probably just not even put it on my hotbar. I'll probably just keep it on, like, in the backpack, and then when I need it, I'll put it in my secondary hand. My, my, my left hand, I guess. 
Because the right hand is the primary. Everyone is on board is, is a righty. Unless you use brutal handwork, which I am, but Keith is still a righty. I am a lefty, personally. I was once a righty, after... Ooh, that's new. But a little bit of story time while we get out of here. I've broken my left arm like six times, so I've used my right hand quite a bit in my in my early days. Little, little itty bitty kills in like the like kindergarten and pre-K. First grade and such. I used my right hand a lot for writing, but then I kind of just stopped breaking my arm, stopped being dumb and falling off things I shouldn't. And now we're here. Which kind of sucks, because honestly, right-handed is more useful for PC. But I guess I guess having both is good. Let's see, long blunt level 5. Nice. Yeah, that's enough about that. Take a little smoky. On our way back. Let's see, anything else? Some in the kitchen I can see. Yeah, they all just look like shadows. Make sure we're good. Seem to be a-okay. Although I'm hearing quite a bit. Alright, let's kill you. Let's get, let's get out of here, because I, I can't see. It's getting close to midnight. Get away from the tree. There we go. Nice. Alright, well. I'm gonna head back to the RV. Get a good night's rest with Keith. And get Keith a good night's rest. And uh, I'll see you guys in the morning. Or whenever he decides to wake up. Because I don't know. He's being unpredictable. Alrighty guys. Back at the hospital 540 in the morning. Keith actually woke up on time. And I keep on forgetting that if you get to the drowsiness level 4. Whatever that's called. Like it, extremely tired or whatever. You can just go to bed. You don't need beta blockers or alcohol or anything. Doesn't matter. You can just sleep. So, now that I know that, life has been good. I just have to remember it. Sun is coming up. Let's check our stats while we walk. Wait, has flatlined to 78. I hate a whole box of cereal right before I left the RV to get back here. Paper weapon is still the crowbar. How many kills do we have to that dang crowbar? Like, seriously. But, uh, 3,755 Zeds killed. One month, 20 days, and I never survived. Let's have it open, head over to the front of the hospital. See what's going on. Let's kill some Zeds in here. I haven't actually been into this park too much. Can't just stay on the outside, out, outskirts. I forgot how to talk. That's probably why I don't do long episodes like this. Well, I mean, only 10 minutes above schedule. That's fine. Let's see. Mm. Not much, which is actually a, the good thing. Good sign. Means we did our job. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Anyone new on the floor? See one outside. I hear at least another one. Hello. Sprint around corners, folks. It'll save lives. Save your life. Alright. Kinda hoping the sun goes up a bit more today. I don't know, it might be just be cloudy. Cause this this is this is screenshot worthy, honestly. I wanna get a I wanna get a nice picture of it. This is a momentous occasion. At least the inside is pretty bright. Okay. Let's go up to the third floor. This is it folks. We just gotta clear it out. Make sure my mags are reloaded. Come on down. There you go. Give you all the old one two schmack roo. One two slash roo, I suppose. More accurate. Okay. Oh, y'all know what to do here. You go up halfway, and then you book it. 
Just in case. There's another floor. Okay. This might be longer than long. There we go, though. Okay. Swap mags now. Let's see what's going on. Anything up here? Hopefully, no. Nothing there. Looking good, looking good. That's where they were falling. Both sides of this, I suppose. Room by room. That's how we do it. Don't know where that guy's going. Feels weird shooting up a hospital, but it's for a good cause. There are zombies. Don't take that out of context. Looks like we're good, though. Hello? I hear you. Oh, that's a locked room. Hold on. We have to come back for that. That could be good stuff in there. That could be more beta blockers. Clear. Room by room. This is how we do it. That's a weird room. Don't want to know what's going on in there. Looking good. Sounds like the one in here? No. Might be above me. Sound is good, but it's also kind of weird in Zomboid. Because you never know. Sometimes you get it, sometimes you don't. Seems like most of these are clear, though. I think I can just run through here. I'm not hearing anything. Okay, nice. Yeah, this place is looking good. I think. Oh, we still gotta check out the next floor. I'm hearing a lot of them over here. Okay, I don't wanna go up those stairs. I'm gonna be real. I'm gonna go up to the main stairs. That sounds like hell waiting for me. We'll cut back around this side. There are still some zeds we can kill over here. Where are you? There you are. Nice. More. Goodbye. Reload. Might be a last full mag. I could have got a long shot on her. I saw that. Two of you in there. Back through here. Watch all sectors for enemy combatants. These stairs might be safer, but I do want to go up the double, the double wide. Gotta repack the mags though, just to make sure we're safe. There we go. Are we good? We're good. Alright, hopefully this is it. This might be like roof access and some other buildings that are coming down. Anyone else? I wanted to run up these stairs, but I also was kind of kind of scared of doing so. Okay. Final floor. Got the machete. It is still 7 in the morning. We don't have to be rocking out shells. Or casings. They sound... Yeah, they're munching over there. That's locked. That's elevators. We don't have to worry about that. Might be some tools and stuff in there. Come on, then. Very nice, very nice. Let's head through here. Yep, I heard you. I gotta be all nosy about it. There you go. Anyone back here? Just quickly run through here. 
Doesn't seem like it. I don't, oh, no, there's one. Nice. Alright, that spot's clear. What's in here? Is this a bathroom? Supply room. Okay. Didn't expect that. I'll tell you what. That room is very empty. Looking good, looking good. Still gotta check out the roof. That's actually the final point we have to go to. Let me just make sure I'm good here. Mags are good. Back to the machete. Boom, 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 boom. Soundboard music just kind of hits a good way. Let me see. Kind of running out of things to say, honestly. Oh, yeah, there they are. Okay. That's what I was hearing. More supplies. Good, good, good. You didn't burn everything. Let's get pistol out for this. Hello, Sheriff. I didn't see you in there. Ooh, that's a another secure room. Jam. I don't know why you have to rack it twice, Keith. I did not tell you to do that. I don't know when that bug started, but I know it started. A while ago. That's another room. Nice. Reload. Repack. Feeling pretty safe, honestly. He's kind of taking it, taking it slow. We're going on 46 minutes on this recording now. But it's worth it. I think your count's going up. Body count is also going up. Don't take that out of context. Like, I mean literal bodies on the floor. Until they despawn. Okay, let's go check over here real quick. What's going on over here? Looking good. Okay, nice. Let's get out of here. Go to the roof, I think. The main stairs stopped at this floor, so I'm guessing this is roof access. Let the bodies hit the flow. And let Keith rise up to become the one true survivor of Knox County. Yep, this is roof. Okay, I thought the floor was missing. No, we're good. Let's get out of here. Holy Jesus, we did it. I expected to do it all day, but honestly, I wanted to. Because there are bigger and brighter things for Keith. At least I hope so. Still gotta finish the base. And we've got a whole map to explore. Well, I'll tell you what. I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Let me just make sure we're good. Okay, yeah. Let's sit down right here. Nice little uh, scenic view with the fog rolling below us. Let me just get this right. There we go. Got a machete out because don't want Keith pointing a pistol at himself. Let me just get him ready for the outro. There we go. Whoa. Let me just get him a smoke. Let's check his stats while he does that. Let's see. Weight is going down. That is to be expected as always. Favorite weapon is the crowbar. Yo, 3,804 Zeds. That is quite the number going up a lot every day. He survived for one month, 20 days, 12 hours. On the dot. Very nice. Well, if you like this type of stuff and you want to see Keith's story adventure... I mean, let me try that again. If you want to see st Keith's story continue, make sure you hit that like button down below. I consider subscribing as well. It is free. You can unsubscribe whenever. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.